coverage for you on this busy election day. Mugo Odigwe is watching the mayoral race and Asal Rizai at the Loop Super site. Let's kick it off with Mugo in that high stakes crowded race. Yeah, good morning. So after months of campaigning, today is the day voters finally get to decide who they'd like to see as the next mayor of Chicago. But as we know, this race is still very much a toss up. We're talking about nine candidates here who spent months campaigning. Almost all of those candidates used yesterday to try and sway undecided voters or those who've yet to cast a ballot. And that includes Congressman Jesus Chuy Garcia and Cook County Commissioner Brandon Johnson. Other candidates in the race include Alderman Roderick Sawyer and Alderman Sophia King. And then there's State Representative Cam Buckner, activist Jamal Green, and businessman Willie Wilson. There's also the current perceived frontrunner, former CEO of Chicago Public Schools, Paul Vallis. And finally, there's incumbent Mayor Lori Lightfoot, who is in a fight to save her job. We spoke with some voters this morning at a polling place in Wicker Park. Crime is uh, obviously important, and I think uh, the city of Chicago is one of the greatest cities on the planet, certainly in this country, and we need to do things that are going to be uh, fruitful for business and expanding our business base and get people back into the city. So, I mean, those are the two things that were important for me, and, uh, and I think that you need a consensus builder in, as a leader. Now... Remember, candidates need 50% plus one in order to win this election outright. Otherwise, we know the top two contenders will go off in a face-off, which is now set for April 4th. We're live in Wicker Park. Mugodigwe, CBS 2 News.